God, where's that pizza, girl? Yeah, I want that pizza. I'm, I'm hungry. hungry. <laughs> <laughs> We're still at the same time. What's up, guys? I'm Jesse. And I'm Emma. And, and we're, we're Gemma. Gemma. Well, welcome back. Um, we told you guys we weren't going to promise us that schedule, and now you're getting videos three weeks in a <laughs> row. Like, all we have to do is not have a schedule, and suddenly we have a have schedule. A schedule. <laughs> so today uh, is going to be a very interesting day. Um, we're going to eat pizza. Yum. Yes, bitch. Domino's on fleek. Domino's McFing. We got that, uh, that two medium pizzas, oh. cinnamon rolls, uh, what was it, Parmesan sticks, and root beer root for 20 beer. bucks. Yeah. 20 bucks, bitch. Like, Hashtag Steelers, bitch. You can't, you can't beat that. So, like, we're going to have a domino, Domino's McFing. We're going to talk about our Ooh. lives and what's going on in our lives right now. Some things are a little hush, hush. So, mm, Ooh. can't talk about those, but. No. <laughs> Not yet. We're gonna tell you guys everything that's going on with us right now. And if you're not a fan of mukbangs, and if you're not a fan of us just talking about our lives, then, then die. Move by. No, just kidding. Just kidding. Don't die. Uh, we're just kidding. We love you guys. But yeah, we're waiting for the food right now. We got it delivered because we're lazy bitches. Um, so, okay, the driver is actually on the way. I have the Domino's tracker, so we're gonna have pizza soon. Yes. Food. So you get to watch us eat. <laughs> If you guys are confused, we're also streaming now, live on you now, so, if we, so that if way we people look, can see behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. If we do look down at any point in time, it's because we are streaming on you now at the moment, while we um, <laughs> we're streaming on you now while we film our YouTube videos. So if you guys want to see behind the scenes of Gemma videos, follow most likely Emma because normally when we do behind the scenes, it's on Emma's you now. But we'll have both of our you nows uh, linked in the description below and you can fan both of us and so whenever we film Gemma videos you get to see behind the scenes and today we're actually filming like a ton of them so yep. you'll get a lot of behind the scenes <laughs> the pizza's here oh the pizza's here uh -huh. I'm scared oh my god pizza. we got the food show them the food show them mm, the food pizza oh, oh. mukbang <laughs> mukbang is ready god <gasps> Oh, look at these oh, cinnamon those look twists. So good. Look at these cinnamon oh sticks. Oh, those look so good. All of the fucking food. Look at those parmesan bites. Those parmesan bites look so good. Look, those look so good, guys. Do you love me? Do you wanna be my friend? If you do, welcome to me. Oh, that's good. Friend, take me by the hand if you want to. I think this is how love goes. Check yes or no. Oh, this looks so good. Oh my gosh. All of y'all that say pineapple don't belong on pizza are fucking wrong, bitch. Like all the pineapple. Look how good that looks. Pineapple belongs on pizza. I'm telling you. Do you remember? Do you remember when we went? We went to McDonald's one. <laughs> we went to McDonald's one time, and we were like, "Do they have like a forty piece?" Like we didn't know if they had a forty piece. So we we rolled up. We're like, "Okay, I do, forty pieces isn't on the menu." So we're just like, "Can we have two twenty pieces?" And they put it in the system, and it pops up on the screen as forty <laughs> pieces. So we were like, "Fuck, I'm stupid. We should have asked for a forty piece." <laughs> Oh my god, do you remember? I think we talked about this in the video, but I'm not sure. Because we're talking about fast food since we're eating. When we went to the frozen dessert... Oh, thank you for becoming a fan. When we went to the dessert kiosk, yeah, and right. I had that crazy makeup. And he was like, did you guys just come from a fucking drama performance <laughs> or something? And I was like, what? I'm you know, beautiful, fuck you. If you guys watch the... Um it was the five tips for stress video. I think so, yeah. The five tips for stress video. In that video, Emma has kind of crazy makeup. It wasn't even that crazy. Like, it was it was a little My bit out there. My contour was crazy. Yeah, My the contour the contour was crazy, but it was crazy. The contour was crazy, but everything else was fine. But, like, we go to get ice cream, and um, we walk in, and the guy was like, did you guys just come from, like, a play or something? And we're like, no, we just came from work. Did you just take my olive, bitch? No. Rude. <laughs> so, um, the guy was like, did you just come from a play or something? We're like, no, we just got off work. He was like, oh. But like... I'm like, so good, dude. <laughs> I was like, do we look like we came from a play? Yeah, he was like, um... He was like, oh, 
you guys look really good. And I was like, um. <laughs> oh my god, I was so flirting with you, bitch. Oh my god, he was flirting with me hardcore. Like he was like, feel he wanted he so. He gave me a. <gasps> what do you mean? <laughs> okay, it's not even more broken than it already was. Did he give me like a discount on the ice cream? I think he did. Yeah. He did. He wanted it. Oh he my was... god. And the guy who sat in his car next to us for like a fucking Oh my hour. god, that was so creepy. We would not move because this guy would not leave. He just like sat there for so long. And I was like, No, he what was in the, the driver's seat of like the car next to us and he was literally staring into our car. <laughs> like staring into our car. So like one, we had somebody like think that we were coming from a play because we had crazy makeup. Two, the guy that thought we were coming from a play was hardcore flirting with me the whole time we were there. And he was like, you look so cute. And he's like, where do you work? Oh, what do oh, you yeah. do? And he's like, everything I said, he would like do that fake laugh. He'd be like, haha, well. And like, I was like, you are flirting with me, dude. He was hardcore flirting. And then we left and we got in the car and we were eating our ice cream in the car. Some guy comes out behind us, gets in his car next to us, and is staring into our car. He was staring. Oh, it was so fucking creepy. It was so creepy. The whole boat. Oh my gosh. When we went walking that last time. <gasps> that had a that fire so under creepy. the bridge. <laughs> we have so oh many stories. God. Like So we went on this walk, okay? And we were walking. We used to walk back at my old apartment. I don't live there anymore, so I'll say where it was. It was, um, it was the Trinity Trail in Fort Worth. And so we walked that trail a lot. When we hung out, we filmed. Then we'd go walk to catch Pokemon, do Pokestops, do gyms. And so we went out. <coughs> Are you okay? I choked on my food. And so we went out when it was dark. And it was getting darker. And we were walking. And so we sat down at these benches. But then there's a bridge by the benches. And I look over and I say, is that a fire? And Jess just looks at me. And she looks over and she's like, I think there's a fire. So we both like go over there. And we're walking under the bridge. Mind you, I have a boyfriend, and she has a boyfriend, slash had a boyfriend, slash has a boyfriend again. So No, at the time I didn't. Okay, well, at the time at she the didn't. At the time I didn't, so... Okay, just to clarify, we're, we're just... I didn't want to say this next part. People like, Jeva, official? <laughs> and so we, um, we're we walking, and there's this guy with a fire under the bridge. So I look over at Jess, and in my mind, I'm like, okay, I'm going to grab her hand, but am I going to act like she's my girlfriend, or I'm going to act like we're family? And so I immediately went to girlfriend, so I'm like, grab my hand, because this guy yeah. has a fire under and, and, the bridge. And like, like, <laughs> Emma's taller than me and obviously transitioning, so she she's really protective of me since I'm obviously, that day I was wearing a dress and stuff, and obviously at the moment, you're going to look really feminine soon, and you do look feminine now, but at the moment she doesn't look super feminine. Beard. Yeah, at the time she had the beard and everything because she hadn't shaved, so she was like, Okay, I look like a, a, a little bit of a man right now, so I'm gonna put Jess on the other side of me and walk next to this hobo. So she's like, get on this side, and like moves me to the other side of her, grabs my hand, and we walk under the bridge. <laughs> I try not to laugh because we walk under the bridge, and she goes, so are we gonna go see your family? <laughs> and she, and then, but, but she keeps it together, and she goes, oh yeah, we're gonna go see my mom, she's excited to meet you. <laughs> yeah. And then we literally hold hands for like the next 10 minutes just to mm -hmm. make sure that this yeah. guy isn't watching us. Because like, I think the reason you did that, I noticed this and I think you noticed it too. When we went, walked up to the bridge, I was wearing a dress that day. Mm -hmm. And like I looked, I had my hair up and I think I was wearing makeup. So I looked, you know, really feminine that day. And I obviously have big tits, so. <laughs> so we walk up to the bridge and that guy, the homeless guy, he looks, I saw him look over and he looked me up and down. I think that's why you moved me to the other side. I, I yeah. think you noticed that too. He looks me up and down, so Emma puts me on the other side of her and was like, mm -mm, girl, like we ain't doing this today. Get over here. <laughs> because even for a man, even when I look like a man, I have a, a round butt. Mm -hmm. So I usually wear clothing that show off my butt. So from behind, even before I even started transitioning, people thought I was a woman. Mm -hmm. And so I knew since he saw us from front, front first, that he'd see that I at least was a man so that way he wouldn't try anything mm -hmm. because when I have a beard and everything, voice aside, I kind of look intimidating, so. Yeah, so. I was like, I got you, bitch. <laughs> get, get over here. That wasn't the first time. Like, that guy that was, like, walking, that guy, we, we stopped this guy one time. Another mm -hmm. time we were walking, um, it was me and 
was I don't think Taylor was there at that time. It was just me and you with, with the crane. Just me and you. We were looking at the crane and we we couldn't figure out what kind of bird it was and we were arguing because Emma was like, "It's a crane, bitch," and I was like, "No, but that doesn't look like a crane. Like that's not a crane." So there was this guy that was walking and Emma stopped him and was like, "Hey, what kind of bird is that?" And he was like, "It's a crane," and then she was like, "See, bitch," and so like. You know, we didn't think anything of it. We stopped this guy on the trail and asked him what the bird was. And so we, we kept walking. And then we turn around. The guy was walking. We were walking this way. The guy was walking this way. So he was going in the opposite direction, like the way we were coming from. Mm -hmm. But when we turned around, he was following us. He had turned around to go the same way we were. And every time we turned around, he would stop and, like, you know, look at other stuff. So this guy was following us <laughs> legit following us and we sat down on the benches and he walks past us and sits on the bench like a little bit further but kept looking over his shoulder and so like that whole time emma was like sitting next to me like on guard like anytime I, we go anywhere you're super like protected and i lost my key that day so i was oh, worried yeah. that he was trying to follow us back to my place and brought my shit oh yeah because you had lost your key but yeah, this guy, he kept looking back at us, and he was following us and stuff. Like, there are crazy people in Fort Worth, like... Well, when I was holding on to Matthew, that was just my instinct. It was like, oh, protect my friends, mm -hmm. because they... Because you protected me. You mm -hmm. stood up for me for customers. I mean, it's I a double road. I have stood up so much. I mean, we, we, we both help each other, so it wasn't... Yeah. It's not, it's not like a... For those of you who don't know our dynamic, it's not an attraction thing. Or, oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have to protect you because, ugh. It's just that it's, I just think that's how friends should be. We're supposed yeah, to stick we're very protective over each other. Like, y'all know we used to work together. Um, we don't anymore. I still work there. Emma doesn't, so we can't talk about it. Um, <laughs> but Not yet. Hope. <laughs> can't say that. But yeah, um, we used to work together, and obviously Emma is a trans woman, and so there were customers that were really fucking rude and would go out of their way to say he and him oh, yeah, and time. sir and <laughs> oh my god, there was this one. <clears throat> Emma had to hold me back because I almost jumped the counter this day. There was this lady that was, you were checking out. Mm -hmm. And um, she, when she was leaving, she turns around and goes, thank you, sir. Uh -huh. I was ready to jump the fucking counter and Emma grabbed my arm and was like, girl, it's not worth it. But I was like, this bitch about to die. Like, I was ready to fucking fight. I was like, girl, you need this job. Calm down. <laughs> like, I was ready to fight this old bitch because, like, that was so disrespectful. Oh my god. Oh, I was just, so mad. You do that your whole life. I think that I just got used to it. Yeah. And since Jess was a new friend, she didn't. She she she, she was defensive. I, I was defensive with you. Remember when? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. So Jess went to take trash out one day, right? Oh gosh. And she went to the dumpster. And then she doesn't come back for a minute. I think you like had to take a minute after it happened. There was there's a military base by our job, like not a base but like a recruiter office. And she went to take the trash. And then when she came back, she had like tears in her eyes. She was wiping them away. I was like, bitch, what's wrong? Like, who do I have to go kill? These guys literally. What did they say? Weren't they like? They were. They, there were these guys that were. Um, They're working out with the military people. <clears throat> I go, like, they were right by the dumpsters, because you know how they work out in the back mm -hmm. of the building, and the dumpster's in the back of the building, and they work out in the back of the building. So I go back there, and I go to, like, throw the trash out, and when they see me walking up, a couple of the guys start laughing and, like, you know, nudging each other. Mm -hmm. And then they started making vomiting noises while mm -hmm. looking at me. They started making vomiting noises, and then um, one of them, like, was, like, fatty or something like that. They said something. And so when I came back from taking the trash, I had to go to the back room and I just sat there for like, mm -hmm. I took a 10, I, I, think, I think I told you because it was just me and you, I said I'm taking a 10, yeah. and I went to the back and I sat there for a while because like, that was fucked up, like I was just doing my job taking the trash, I did not ask for this. And then, so she, when she, when, I think I went back to you, mm -hmm. because we had, the store had been empty, so I went back to her, and I was like, okay girl, what's wrong, why are you crying, did something happen, like, and she was like, well this, she told me the story. She told me what happened, and I went off. I was like, I'm going out there right now. No. I will march the fuck over there. No, she was like, who are they? What did they look like? I'm going to go tell the recruiter. I'm going to go tell him right now what these bitches did. Like, she was ready to go tell the recruiter and get them kicked out. Like, That's she just, was ready. <laughs> it's bullshit, and like, like Justin said, she stuck up for me. And no one should be body shamed. We're all beautiful with the bodies we have. And we might not like the bodies we have, but that's for us to decide, not anyone else. 
Just like no one can judge me or get on my feet and say, well, you're a man. Well, I'm not a man. Regardless of what you see or what you hear, I'm more woman probably than most women you know. True. <laughs> I'll just see one more piece. So yeah, um, we're really protective over each other. Like, I think that's what friends should just yeah, be. Yeah, that's how friends should be. Like friends that just watch bad shit happen to you and don't bat an eye, like those aren't good friends. Those are shitty people. Now I get it if you're not reacting and you tell them not to react. Yeah. But like if you're obviously upset but you can't defend yourself, I feel like as a friend, the the friend should stick up for them. Like, mm -hmm. oh my god. And you've been like, the only friend that I've had that I've only had one fight with. <laughs> Every other friend, and these, I'm talking six, seven year friendships, where I've had so many fucking fights, and it's just like, oh my god, like, why? It's like we're in a fucking relationship, we fight so much. <laughs> but that's what a friendship is, it's a form of relationship. Mm -hmm. It's not boyfriend, girlfriend, or sister, sister, brother, 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 sister, sister, brother, mom, dad. Like, it's a... It's still, you just have to put work into a friendship. Like, we can't mm -hmm. just say we're friends, but then never talk, never see each other. Like, even if we can't see each other because of conflicting schedules or because of my car situation at the moment, we we still text, we still talk, we still message each other. I mean, there's never a moment where we're just like, bye, bitch. <laughs> Not talking for a month. True. God, I feel so fat. Like, I have three pieces, and then you just have <laughs> your... I ate two pieces. That's a lot. <laughs> a true story. I used to wear my heels to work. You guys have seen them in one of the videos, the last two videos we did. But I have like multiple. That's not my only pair. And I would fall down the stairs, like scrape myself up. I'd be bleeding. Like I'd feel like my leg broke. And one day I fell down the stairs so bad that this teacher saw me and she's like, are you okay? And the first thing I told her is, are my heels okay? I didn't even give a fuck about Man. myself. And that moment in time, my brain went to, are my shoes okay? Oh my god, I feel like I'm just gonna regret eating all this food later. Oh my gosh, girl, chill. I'm gonna save it for later. I still have two pieces. <laughs> I think that we're different people with the camera on, and we've talked about this. Yeah. I think the camera just makes us, because if you look, when we first started making videos till now, we're both completely different people. Like, I, I honestly can say, I don't think we wanted to share the spotlight at first, because we both would look so bitchy when the other talked. We oh looked God. so bitchy. Like, if you go we back, like, <laughs> why are you I'll talking? Link it, I'll link it at the beginning of this description. Um, our five tips for stress video look at the way we look at each other because like anytime i'm talking she's just like like you rolled your eyes a couple times and there's times when she's talking i'm just like mm -hmm. like we were so fucking salty to like anytime the other was talking like i'll link that video at the beginning of the description like that was a good video like we gave some really good advice but we were bitches to each other <laughs> i don't think we wanted to share the spotlight but now but now that we've been doing it for a while we're more comfortable <laughs> in our status quo and how we are. Look how good he's like. They didn't give us marinara! Those bitches! You can't have garlic knots without marinara. What the fuck? I'm suing. <laughs> Domino's, look out for a fucking lawsuit. <laughs> We're gonna win too, okay? We're two fat girls. We gonna win. <laughs> we are the source of your income. <laughs> we pay your bills, Domino's. You know, this looks so good too, but we don't have any marinara. You can't eat them without marinara. All I we have like is icing. <laughs> we can dunk them in icing. I am not putting. No, because then you're gonna get the garlic and the icing, and then you can't dip your cinnamon sticks in there because there's garlic in your fucking icing. These are good, but they'd be better with marinara sauce. I was about. I was just gonna say. I was like. These taste really good, but I know they could be better. Yeah. If you have fucking marinara sauce. I like how I just ate an entire fucking pizza basically by myself and I'm still fucking eating. <laughs> and I'm talking about losing weight. Oh, this one has so much butter and it just went everywhere. I bit it. <gasps> ah! Oh my god. Girl, ew, look at that. 
Ew. Ew. Look, that is like drenched in butter. Girl, oh, uh, they trying Will to get it focus? Her? It's not focusing. Focus. Whatever. Touching. Take my word for it. It's drenched in butter. Okay, now we are suing Dawn. <laughs> Oh, why did I eat the rest of it? Ew, it's like all butter. I wanted to do it. What the fuck? You had butter all over your hand. <laughs> you ruined my shot. I'm sorry. Look at that icing. Oh, that looks so good. Even though I can't see it. Oh, I know it looks good. Look at that. It's a mic and you haven't even burped once. I did burp while you were talking earlier. I burped. And then I said, excuse me. That roll eye I did, that's how we were in the stress paper. That's how I am every day of my life talking to you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> True feelings revealed. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Look, these look so good. Oh, girl, you're being snatchy. We should have got two. I know you've been about to double dip. We should have got two, what, icings? Yeah. Bitch, I don't double dip. I don't give a fuck if you do. I don't give a shit about germs. Oh. Is it good? Oh my god, what the fuck? It looks like cum. No, 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 no. <laughs> it was so gooey. That's where I tell my man every night. You know it's good icing when it looks like cum. <laughs> oh my god, it's all over my fucking lips. That's what I say to my man every night. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, is that the first time I said that? <laughs> we can call Bryce right now. <laughs> Whoops. Oh my god. They're spicy. Spicy? There's a lot of cinnamon on this bitch. Cinnamon it's is not spicy. Why do you think people do the cinnamon challenge? I think it's because that icing isn't cold. Icing's supposed to be cold. Not when you have these, it's warm. <laughs> and gooey. Yeah, we don't even have to keep making the joke. It just makes itself. <laughs> I mean, they're cinnamon rolls. Mm. Or cinnamon sticks, I should say. But they're dense. That's why they squirt so much. Oh. Comedy gold. Mm. Mm -hmm. My man knows I'm a pervert, so it's okay. I mean, oh my I'm... Jesus H. Christ! There's so much. It just keeps dripping. That's what she said. <laughs> That's what I say to my man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ooh, Honey, that is a good. Oh drip. yeah, that's a good drip. <laughs> yes. Mm. Mm, juicy. Yes. <laughs> Looking like a snack. You gotta get that protein. <laughs> <laughs> Let's turn from a muffin to just us being sexual. <laughs> Best way to avoid babies. <laughs> yeah, you don't want babies to swallow. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to swallow these breadsticks. <laughs> oh, cinnamon sticks, excuse me. Oh, it like dripped all over the rest of them. Mm. <laughs> oh my god, Trisha, goddess. Trisha is the mukbang goddess. <laughs> That's what we look up to. Her on Twitter. Yes. Get that shit out. Trisha. I mean, not only are we doing a mukbang, we're talking about sex, her two favorite things, food and sex. <laughs> Hashtag sex puns for days. Oh god, I can't eat another one. I was going to, oh, but like, my stomach hurts. Oh my god, that one's so bad. Mm, that look at this. juicy. Ooh, it's just dripping with that cinnamon. Look at oh, that. Oh yeah, I'm gonna eat it's one more. It's a big daddy. Oh my god, this one's retarded. <laughs> Me. <laughs> okay, so guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. We spilled a little tea. Spilled some tea, spilled Ate some butter. Ate <laughs> like, some food, some icing. It got a little uh, sexual there at the yeah. end. <laughs> what, what, what good mukbang doesn't? <laughs> it ain't good unless it's dirty. True. <laughs> uh. Yeah! Finally, I've been over here burping like a bitch and I, I was like- I burped earlier, that was the second one. I didn't hear it, I burped like six times. <laughs> okay guys, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and definitely we will be doing this again in the future, hopefully with both of our significant others. Well anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always trainers, gotta, gotta watch, watch them all. Bye. Bye.